Hybrid systems of turbines and fuel cells are a promising technology for meeting power efficiency targets that will help eliminate, at competitive costs, environmental concerns associated with the use of fossil fuels for power and transportation. NETL's Hybrid Performance, or HYPER, facility is a one-of-a-kind laboratory built to develop control strategies for the reliable operation of fuel cell turbine hybrids and enable the simulation, design, and implementation of commercial equipment. The HYPER facility provides a unique opportunity for researchers to explore issues related to coupling fuel cell and gas turbine technologies. A fuel cell is an electrochemical device that produces electricity from hydrocarbon fuels without combustion, while a turbine produces electricity by expanding steam or hot gases to spin its blade. When the two devices are combined into an integrated power producing system, the combined system achieves fuel efficiency and emissions performance that surpass any single standalone system. However, controlling the flow of power from both the fuel cell and turbine is expected to be more complicated than in conventional power systems. To overcome these complexities, NETL's Hyper Facility integrates virtual representations of the developing technologies. Simulations are coupled to physical hardware, such as heat exchangers and a turbine, in order to evaluate the dynamics of a fully integrated system. This allows control strategies to be developed and tested before actually implementing the technology, reducing risk. The test facility was designed to isolate and independently instrument each component of the system. Research programs initiated by the Department of Energy to achieve increased efficiency and reduced emissions are expected to result in integrated power generation technologies that are responsive to consumer demand. Fuel cell turbine hybrids produce clean electricity and would use far less fuel to produce the same power as technologies used today. Such a highly efficient system could extend our natural resources and dramatically reduce the release of CO2 and criteria pollutants to the environment.